Let's go, guys. Lucky. And today, I am going to be starting a new series of um, a series of uh, once a week, or at least once a week, picking a different oval. Because I have my wall of ovals. Well, that's most most of my ovals, um, and I haven't picked most of them. So I thought to get through them at least once a week, um, let's just get some picked. And uh, yeah, so to um, to start off, I think we just got to go something, go the classic, go, go Lockwood. So, um, okay, we'll just pick... Let's go here. Ooh, nice bissing on that. Jeez. Okay, all right, well, let's get him in a vice and give it a go. So, these older, older ones, they might have... They might have um, the tapered pins, or they might have the uh, standard thin lip spools. So, if they've got tapered pins, we might be in for a long video. Because <laughs> I suck at spicking them. But, let's uh, get in there with uh, the Happy Bar. And uh, SS Dev, and let's hope for spools. So I'm going to start off with super light tension. All right, there's a the spool. There we go. That was number two. Right. Two again, so he's set. I think he's a bit of a high lift, so I can't quite. Oh, got someone. Five in the back. Okay, so we've got a little bit of a falsetto going on. Okay. A little bit more reach. I don't like this, this profile, because it's very thick. So, if you go there, and we've got low cuts in one or two, you're, uh, you're pretty well just oversetting them, just by sticking your pick in and going to the back. Halfway through the spool. Come on. Alright, and I overset something in the process. Okay, nice deep false set now. One is binding. Lost my false sets because I overset two. Right, that's three. Nice deeper false set. One still springy. Okay, that's four. Okay, need a bit of reach to get 
and the pin two. That's feeling good. Now pin one's binding counter. Oh, it's still binding. Ping pong them back and forth. Because there's no spring tension, you have to uh, force the uh, counter rotation, which if you don't do it well, you drop everything, as I just did. Okay, we've got our deep fault set back. And the back is feeling good. Okay. Going through and looking for the binder. No movement on the back. Okay, so it must be one or two. I'm going to touch on two. See what number one's doing. All right, number one is set. There we go. It was one hiding behind the uh, hiding behind the tensioner, bastard. All right, so let's get him. Give him a quick gut. Let's lock him up and get the music going.
had uh, just the standard Lockwood tapered pens. I'll obviously be putting the close-ups um, in the top corner. They're really, really nicely tapered. Um, and uh, this lock was not very, uh, did not go through much use, I don't believe. Okay, and we've got these standard uh, Lockwood tapered pens. So a couple videos back, Pocket Woman uh, noticed that my close-up of the pins for um, uh, this guy here, which is a, a brand new one, um, had little tapers on the thin lip spools. Now this lock, I think it, it's a, a, about 10 years old, so I can't really see now, but I'll put the close-up photos on screen I, I can't see any tapers on these um, just by looking at them but they are the standard uh, well what I would call standard um, thin lip spools so this the these rings in these um, these ovals are always all the same and they're very strong. I think they're steel. Yeah, so Mr. Magic Pick does, doesn't react to these, although I, I have a feeling that, that these guys are, are stainless, but uh, yeah, these guys, they are real strong thin um, springs, uh, steel springs, yeah, so, oh, okay, all right, enough with you, Magnet, okay, so, yes, that is, oh, sorry, missed out on the core in the Bible and such, so, Nothing special about the Bible, just uh, standard Lockwood, old, old logo, and nothing is special about the core. It is a six pin core, only pin to five. There is parts for drill protection, but they are not populated um, standard for these. And these are just, yeah, brass, just coated. All right, that is going to be all. Any questions, comments, suggestions, chuck them down below. And until next time, guys, stay well, stay safe, stay sane. Hooroo.